Hello everybody, I'm Tom and you are watching me play Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Um, today, I don't really know what we're going to do. We're going to go back to Ashna Castle at some point, but harvest is not yet complete. Um, we have to go back to Ashna Castle at some point, but... I want to make sure I've done everything before I go back there. Because it feels like it's kind of wrapping up. I might be wrong, but... Like, I can't warp anywhere here except for the abandoned dungeon, but... Actually, the abandoned dungeon may be the fastest way to get there, in all honesty. Um... Yeah, I guess we just head there. I kind of want to go from Ashina Outskirts and go from, like, uh... The dilapidated temple and just run back through. Or maybe go from... Because clearly we're in like a new world state because apparently Ashna Castle is being like sieged or attacked or something now. Is what I was told by the Black Badger. But... I'm interested to see if there's anything else different in the early parts of the game or whether or not it's just Ashna Castle. This seems normal. Whoops. Yeah, it seems normal so far. I intended to do that, it's fine. I decided to go backwards, so I didn't want to... <laughs> Alright. So what we're going to do is we're going to teleport to... Ashna Castle Gate, and then go from there. But apparently the rats have infested. And the rats... It seems what Ashin was calling the rats at the very least. Hello? Gate is sealed firmly shut. I mean... <laughs> I know a way around this. It's not intended, but I know a way around this. It's a pretty hard jump to make, but... No. Screwed it. Oops. This, by the way, is a way that you can uh, actually skip fighting... Um, what's his name? My name is... Gyobu. There we go. Gyobu the Demon. If you can do this properly, you can actually skip Gobu. There we go. Yoink. Why are you firmly shut? Can I open it from this side? No. Interesting. So I'm not supposed to be here. <laughs> but I am anyway. There doesn't seem to be anything here. Like, I think you're just not supposed to be able to get in here. I may have somewhat broken the game, but you know. Breaking the game's fun. There was like some geckos or something up here. Are they still there? No, they're gone too. I think I'm in an area I'm not supposed to be in, but you know, whatever. I can't possibly break it that much. Come up here. Did I never come this way? I may have never have actually got these items. I wonder if they're still here. Oh, yeah, I totally didn't. This is a way you can come. I found this on a separate playthrough I was doing. <laughs> so that's something at least. It's pretty easy to run through here when there are no damn enemies, so that's something. Um, I may have to do bull skip as well, just to get through here. Yep, I do. Good to know. <laughs> well, I can show off the bull skip. That's something I can do. Alright, uh, so I will cut to my successful attempt of doing this, but essentially what you want to do is you want to run this way, and then you want to jump off the tree at the last possible second and go to the left. That screwed it up. Alright, I'm back. So, with the latest patch, they actually patched out Bullskip. There is another one, apparently, that you can go from this side, but I've never been able to get it. Um, I tried it a few times, I couldn't figure it out. Um, 
Apparently the one on this side isn't patched on the latest patch, which is 1.03, I think it is. It was the patch that came on like the 23rd of April, I think. Um, so that way there I can't go. They've put an invisible wall there so you can't get around. It's quite annoying. Um, I tried it far too many f times before I realized that I wasn't actually doing the jump correctly. I just wasn't going through. But apparently there's another one you can get where you just do this way. Where you run like this and do this and just go around this corner and like land up on there and then you can do essentially the same thing. But I couldn't figure that out either. So I guess I'll give up. Um, what I'll do instead is I'll go to, um, what is the, the other best, there's actually a few that I can go to that'll lead me in to where I want to go. Um, let's travel to Ashna Dungeon, I suppose. That works just as well. Does traveling count as resting? I think it does. Yes, it does. I have no money. I already bought everything off you. That's right. <laughs> um, so can I go out this way? Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. Clearly because everyone else is being attacked, I would say. I mean, just to play it safe. That's weird. I guess that guy's running away because... There's a shinobi hunter? Interesting. Play an enemy. Interesting. They're wearing fairly heavy armor. They're not exactly sneaky in their bright red armor, but... I don't want to get snuck up on them, so I'm going to take the high road wherever possible. Um... The shinobi, they're in the moat. Huh. So they are. Well, this is interesting. Castle Siege. Cool. Hmm. I guess I can't get up there? I can swim underneath though, so that's something. Just searching for more lootables. Cool, carp scale. Uh, I don't know where that carp came from there. He wasn't there before, that's for sure. Someone saw me. 
Oh, hello. More rats. Hell. Jump down. You bitch. He's not going to jump down, annoyingly. Kill him. So that's something. Can I come through this way to get back up? I'm fighting Shinobi at this point. Which makes me want to, uh... Be very, very, uh... Careful. This is all the same. By the look of it. Whoop. People out there fighting, apparently. Snuck. Get sneaked. Also, they drop Gaijin Sugar, which is interesting. Alright, so that's where the broken bridge is. I know where I am, at least. Can I sit here now and reactivate it? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I have to reactivate them, apparently. I know why I rested there. I didn't really need to. Oh, that guy's going to get in a fight. I'm going to go this way. I'll fight the winner. <laughs> this dude just gave me three experience. Well worth it. Uh, it doesn't seem there's any night jars around. At least I haven't seen any yet. Oh, they're dead. They have been absolutely murdered. Which makes sense, because if you're gonna infiltrate this place, you're gonna have to kill the Nightjars first. Huh. Yeah, these Nightjars are screwed. I mean, to be fair, I did the same thing when I run through here, but... I don't want to miss new stuff, but at the same time... I don't want to spend too long wandering around paths. Hello, Senpo Monk. You don't even have a hard hat. I can kill you easily. I can hear more running at me. Come up here, please. Alright, there's a lot of them here. These guys are better at, um... These guys are amazingly good at deflecting me, which 
Can I point that out? Clearly these were the ones who killed the night jars. God damn it. Don't put me right next to the enemies. Alright, they're more observant than I give them credit for. Well, shit, I could die here. Very much so. Heal. You'll notice I'm not actually talking much through these, because... God damn if they aren't good at killing me. Well, one died. <laughs> Fell off the roof by the looks of it. Um... The other ones lose- they lose sight of you really, really quickly, which is nice, I suppose, but... Granted, that could just be where I am. The fact that, like, I'm in an area where... There's a lot of roofs and things that I can kind of avoid. They'll see me immediately, right? Apparently not. No, good. So I think there's one more. I should be able to take one on one, probably fairly easily I would have thought, but maybe not. We'll see I suppose. I'm also being quiet, one because I'm concentrating, but two also I'm using a lot of sound cues for when they jump and when they throw shuriken and stuff. Ha! Eat a dick. Alright, so I killed all them, I think. Like, I'm sure there's more somewhere. But clearly they were the guys sent to kill all the night jars, and they did a fairly good job of it, I may say. Alright, there's a shinobi there. I'm not going to be able to sneak past this guy, surely, right? I guess I can just fight him pretty fairly. Come around this corner and fight me, please. Sweet. That guy's dead. This is really cool, by the way. We're going through the same area with different enemies. That is fucking metal. Come on, Akamaru. Let's kill you. Oh god. Two of them. I don't necessarily want to fight two of them. 
Yoinked. Can they jump over here? I don't think they can. Uh, also worth noting, it's probably doing this, uh, right? I forgot I had it, but the whistle finger. I guess it only works if there's, uh, if they're unalerted. I thought I made him... Oh no, I need to upgrade it to make him crazy. That's right. I remember now. Even so, I've now separated them. I think separated them enough that I can now kill both of them really easily. They give a lot of experience at this place, by the way. I want to point that out. Like 600? It's insane. Alright, so there's another one over there. They didn't make use of the hidey hole, which I was sure they were going to. More dead night jars. Oh, fuck off, dogs. I mean, I can kill you by yourself really easily. Hello. Lock, unlock on, please. Alright. Heal the poison. That doesn't heal poison, it just stops the build up. Heal the poison. Heal. That guy lose me? <laughs> kind of, he's glitching the fuck out. Um, let's see. I'm gonna go back the long way, simply because it seems safer. Alright, that guy's kind of given up. Let's gosh it up. Alright, he's stuck. Out Shinobi. <laughs> Shinobi v Shinobi. Shinobi wins. Hey guys. I mean, just attack me at this point. Cool. Oh. Ah. I never noticed this before, but you get a really good view of um Ashna Reservoir from up here. Uh it's another dead night jar. Oh my god. 
Um, also, shuriken. They're dead. I kind of want to go to the top, but I also want to explore everywhere else. Most notably... Oh, shit. Well. But, but there's a save point in here. Yeah, that won't, <laughs> that won't happen. Um, that's an interesting fight, though. I want to do it. Um, where is my save point? I guess there. That sucks. Although, I think I can probably avoid, like, everything. Pretty easily. Also, items. Shink. Yeah, I, I, I got that much. Um, that made me jump. Stab. Good to know. Oh my god, there's more of them. Well. I mean, I was helping you, dude, but okay, I'll kill you. That was the thing. So I guess I can go in the front door. Sounds like an ogre. Doesn't open from the side, of course it doesn't. Alright, so there's no ogre to kill in there. Good to know. Um, I'm sitting at half an hour already. Um. I don't want to stop, but at the same time, I kind of want to stop. Well, that didn't work the way I wanted it to. Nor did that. There we go. Can't make that jump, unfortunately. Hmm. I guess I kind of have to go up this way, right? Will he run down this path? Doesn't look like it. Alright. I'm just gonna kill this guy.
Help me, dog. My dog now. Kill your master. Wow. Brutal. Well, dog's dead. I mean, the dude's dead. All right. So there should be a way for me to actually cheat and go straight up here. What I was saying. Yeah, I can. Damn it. I think I can probably run up here pretty easily, but... Give me this. Ah. Now I feel much better. Alright, I think I'm going to leave it there, because I'm sitting at 33 minutes. Um, thanks for watching, I shall see you next time, where we're going to continue on this area. I'm going to head back outside, and the reason I want to head back outside is because I want to make sure that... Uh, I've explored everything that I can explore in this area, essentially. A couple of dogs. I think I have. I think next up, it's going to be going to the roof. And also, there's this kind of a speedrunning trick you can do here where you can kind of like, uh... Whoop. I screwed it up. Whoop. I screwed it up. Again, somehow. I also had a massive frame drop there, which was weird. Anyway, ir irrelevant. Next time. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I shall see you next time. Bye.